Hey, what's going on everybody? This is Robert A.J. Strife, author of Castle of Calamity on Death's Door. I suppose this is my first vlog, so welcome. Hit the like on the way in and subscribe. I will have some gameplay from Dead by Daylight or something in the background. So it's just not a disembodied voice speaking to you. I want to talk about my book a little in this video. Now, I gotta say... I had this story for nearly 15 years, and I'm pretty happy now that I've had a chance to make it a reality. George R. R. Martin was a heavy influence on me writing Castle of Calamity. I mean, I read that book series more than 270 times, and yes, that is a real number. Castle of Calamity takes place after a war with a vampire lord rebelling against the throne. Cain, the vampire lord, was forced into a retreat back to Castle Cloveshire where he opened portals to the underworld in his last ditch effort to swell his ranks. The monsters that poured through the portals wiped out the entire province of Closhire, killing men, women, children indiscriminately. The main story takes place 27 years afterwards, and we follow Macrucius Dynasty, son of the war hero Simeon Dynasty, and the Lord of Greyfall. Macrucius was a character I had made when I was playing uh, Dungeons and Dragons during my first campaign. This story is basically 10 years before the events of the tabletop game. Macrucius is a 23 year old introverted monster hunter who's kind of bookish to a fault. He would rather spend his time with his face in a book searching for monsters than to sit on the Lord's seat. I would say that since this is a younger Macrucius, he has an arrogance to him thanks to his dynasty strength. That arrogance is definitely something that could lead to misfortune. I will talk about other characters at some other time. As for other side notes, uh, this is a third person, multiple point of view book to give more perspectives as to what's going on in the world. I would like to add that I am a devil in the details type of person, so you might want to pay attention. So, growing up, I was always a die-hard fan of classic Castlevania games, and that was the inspiration for my characters. I've also used quite a bit of Native American mythology and folklore in my writing. Uh, if I had to compare it, I would say Castle of Calamity is like Castlevania, The Witcher, and A Song of Ice and Fire. The main series has about six books planned, and all of them have been named years ago. Listen... I won't make any promises, but I don't think you have to worry about me writing myself into a corner because the story is already done. I just have to write it. If any of that interests you, snag a copy of the book from the links below to support what I do. There will also be a link to my blog site for more information about Castle of Calamity. Soon I will have a monster bestiary up and running. I uh, suppose that will be all for now, so I'll catch y'all later. Peace.